My three rules for success are, firstly, to recognize the opportunities, but also the risks. And by the way, opportunities are everywhere. You just have to find them. <laughs> Secondly, then to define targets. And the targets that we have set were always quite ambitious because it motivates the people actually more. And then lastly, to implement and do that rather quickly. Success clearly means to achieve the targets or even better, overachieve the targets. To realize something on this world, for instance, the green technologies in Siemens we have sold helped to improve the CO2 by one third of the yearly output in Germany. So that means something really big. It's not just the profit, but it's also that side. And last but not least, that I see team members are growing and further developing in their career. So I think that's really success and that's a very good feeling, but success has never been done by one person. Success, real success can only be achieved with a very motivated teams and, and quite a clear target. I would say in, my, in the earlier years of my career, it was more on profit. You know, I'm making acquisitions, establishing new markets in the emerging uh, world and so on. But then I think the more I got into the sustainability area, so starting with Philips being responsible for sustainability and achieving results which were not just in revenues and profit, but also better results for our planet, I think that obviously has been an even broader impact. What to give to the EMBA students? I think first of all that they're doing the EMBA is great. It's a great start for the next step. So you really get the toolkit to operate a medium or larger sized enterprise. So when going back home, I think the next step is to better understand your own vision. And vision meaning, what is your photo of your own future? And actually few people do that. And then obviously once you realize that, what you want to become, then also work towards that. And what always helps is bring a good result. You know, working well and motivate teams, develop people, I think all these aspects. But lastly also what's important to keep up the network. One more point of advice I would say, I think it's so important to, to make sure there is enough room for your private life. There's also enough room for your own health, meaning sports, etc. Traveling, also sometimes, you know, to be able to relax and not always be in this working meal. I think all this is also a very important factor for your own well-being. Yeah, I think only that way you can really make a sustainable meaning also long-term career and help society to move on. <music>